last week in Townsville. 50. He sees plenty of averages over the 100. Michael Smith. Yeah, we haven't seen one real top-notch performance. Is Price going to put that right? Joe Cullen was the other one. And, uh, 96. Can Price set the board alight? Get in a good performance. Get off the stage early. Like I said, he was upset 25. with the crowd, Stu, but you know, that's the way it is. You know, he's had it for a long time now. and It was the same for both players. Though. I mean, unfortunately, there were... There were people in the crowd who were whistling wow. the, uh, whistle, the whistle I have to say is yeah. the one thing that will bring you out of concentration the, the the big noise and hubbub behind you doesn't really but the whistle is a high pitch thing that goes inside your head and that will take you out of concentration more than anything Kohaka Kiri what about that for a haircut would suit you Rob Vivians Ponytail at the back. Well, I might be able to do the ball bit, but I don't know about the ponytail. 44. Not the greatest of starts from, from the Welshman. As yet, we've not seen anybody take advantage of the indifferent game of the PDC pros. We've seen nearly all of them. Wow. You know, Joe Cullen started off pretty bad. James Wade, Gordon Allen's had a great chance earlier on. Fallon uh, Sherrick, Mel Cummins, missed chances. 93. Yeah, it's been really scrappy at the start. 76. Well, I said, at, I said at the top of the show, still, that you know, if you're going to beat these, you've got to get into them early because they have, they've all been slow starters. Well, he went for the 25-19 for the bullseye. Now he's got to find a treble, which he hasn't done. 86. Going to require 40. Game shown the first leg. Very bright. Second leg, Carl to throw first. Game on. 20 darts. I think James Wade might have taken the opening leg in 22 early. It's just been a bit scrappy, a bit bitty. 45. The problem is you know that the PDC probes all of a sudden, like James Wade did, they're going to find their form. Johnny Clayton did. But before they find that form, you have got to punish them. And if you can punish them earlier on, then it may push back that form 91. they're going to find further and further. And as we see last week, and a couple of games, ended up winning. Puhar had a great win. One. Gordon Mathers did. There's certainly a chance here for Price. That's the perfect first dart. I'll tell you what, after after that first dart, that's a poor return, isn't it? Yes, the uh, professionals, well, even a good player, even a good pub player, once they put the first dart in the treble, they expect to get another one. One thirty-two. Great visit from Kohat. One hundred. Can I require one hundred and fifty-two? There's a good chance here. I mean, Price is on the one hundred and six, which is a good checkout. But Kohad needs to find a treble just to put himself on a two-dart, two-double finish, which is not Can done. Require and he wanted ninety-four the previous leg, ninety-two this leg. And the treble sixteen would have left in the tops. So will he? Will he go for the twenty-five here? <laughs> Kakiri. Oh, you require 92. Or will he go for the treble 20? He went the bullseye rope before and missed it. And he's missed it again. 
two double tops would be nice. 52. Very require 56. Double his lead. Game shot, second leg. Gary Price. Third leg going the through first. Game on. One. Forty-five. Have a closer look at the darts of Kakeri. That very odd, aren't they? I think unique. Just about covers them, but. One twenty-three. Yeah, Simon Whitlock was played with some funny shaped darts in his career, but certainly Kohar's. And obviously that straight bit at the back is where his thumb and forefinger will be. One. More like a bullet, don't they? One man of Let's get the feeling here that the, the world number one is warming up. I really I fancied that the first two darts were so good and, and Price is normally very reliable isn't he on, on double 12 94 3 nil. I mean you require 24 it's on the third leg from going Thank Price you, 13 darts takes him into a 3 nil lead We'll try that one again. Yeah, Kohard needs to just find it. As you can see, he brings that dart in. He's wow. bringing the dart well offline. So he's just as having to overreact to get the dart back. And when you're playing well, throws like that work perfectly. Obviously, it does for him because he's, as Gerwin Price puts in a maximum. It's going to say about Kohar, but when things are not going right, then where just brings it just brings it and faces it offline One runner, well we see price miss a nine data last week oh, that's number four that's number five plenty of room there steve plenty of room perhaps mr price will give us all the favor and pin the nine data this week yeah, Mr. Double 12, Gallo in Price has already hit four big nine darters this year. Always goes to treble 19, first he's hit that. Treble 20. Oh! He'll be disappointed with that dart. He really absolutely, will. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. Oh, Seven perfect darts from Price. He certainly pushed his average up, and that sort of leg helps. He's up to 112 on the front nine scoring. Just under the 100 on his overall average. 129. I mean, you require 56. Game uh, show on the fourth leg. It wasn't a nine dance, but it was an 11 dance. Going to throw first. Four Game nil. On. To get him in price. He's now stepping it up, isn't he? Some great scoring power in the last two legs. 14 and 11 to go 4 0 up. Over the 100 on the average now for Price. Well, the opening leg in 20, then 17. Then 13, then 11. 95. 
Koha Kakiri yet to have a daft and a double. Yeah, as we see Koha's stance there, the legs very close together. Well, he has to keep his balance, but you see going Price back, but that left leg just comes off the floor a little bit, but it certainly doesn't upset the flight of the dart. He's going treble 15 because Kohar's not on a shot. Another 19 would have left in the ball side, but he doesn't have to go that route, especially when his opponent's not on a checkout. Just leaves the double top. Get the job done. In showing the fifth leg. Larry Price, six leg, go out of the throat first. Game on. Yeah, good stuff this from Price. Discount the first couple of legs, which were were not great, but winning him 13, 11, and 14, 57. the last three legs. Well, because the first two legs weren't that good, it's made the last three legs look even better because he's now pushed his average up to over the 100 and that scoring power which is the front nine darts up to over 116 so and 55 percent on his doubles so all in all you know this is a strong performance from the world number one best performance of the night yeah. so far setting the stall out isn't he It's not happened, has it, for Koha Kakiri? One. Price is getting that first dart yeah. so, so perfect. And that's why, when you get the first dart like that, the other two are so easy to follow. What a performance this has been after, say, those opening couple of legs, which were a a bit scrappy, but since then, 55. this has been a, a champion performance. Wins it for an 11 dust. That was some performance from the world number one. An average of 105 as he swept aside the challenge of Koha Kakiri. Really good stuff.